I am mostly interested in colour. Colour and pattern is really what drives my work. I describe it as a big kind of investigation into materials and experimentation. Colour really is not something that I'm scared of um, and it's quite intuitive when I'm working and I tend not to use black because I find that black is quite flat and cartoony so I, I replace black with a, um, like a deep violet colour that makes all the other colours kind of pop. My ideas have changed because I've travelled, I've seen more, um, I've experienced more and just this really I this idea of just wanting to create very beautiful pictures. So at the moment I'm working on an elephant piece uh, and it's a series of paintings where I'm really really starting to explore this kind of idea of pattern working alongside the kind of spray paint marks and the acrylic detail. The elephant image because I've recently become a mother um, just finding myself drawn towards images that are maybe celebrating that kind of mother instinct. I wasn't born in Basingstoke but I've been here for the um, best part of 10 years now and it is a good place to be an artist because it's not an obvious place I think for arts. I think I spent a lot of time thinking oh, I should be in London, you know there's a scene in London or I should be in Brighton, there's a scene. Um, but actually there's something really exciting about building a scene or discovering a scene. And I do think that about Basingstoke, I think it's up and coming. I've had a, a solo show at Proteus and I've been really lucky to be part of a scheme with Festival Place where they've supported a pop-up gallery and that's one of my favourite places where my work's been exhibited because it's so accessible. If you've got a direct relationship with the people that buy from you, it's more personable and I think although a lot of my work people make their own narrative or they see something in it or it reminds them of, of someone or some place. I think when they meet the person that's made it, it makes it extra special for them. The City with Jane art trail was actually my seventh trail that I've been involved with. They're so good in terms of the trails, that idea that you get your work to a really big audience and it's accessible again. Um, to hear that there was going to be one so locally was just brilliant so wanted to be involved and I was lucky enough that two got selected. I love painting because of just being able to make a mess really I mean there's nothing else like it to just immerse myself in so much colour makes me really happy but yeah going to work and not being told do this do this I want it done like that it's you know very lucky.